One of the debates in the psychedelic community right now, where all this very interesting scientific research is going on, is exactly what psilocybin is doing to the brain. Initially, most researchers figured that these drugs excite the brain, and they thought it was kind of flooding the brain with some kind of stimulant. But the more recent research suggested that in one particular structure called the default mode network, activity was reduced. Now the default mode network is kind of a regulator of brain activity. It is closely identified with the ego. It is a transit hub in the brain where signals cross. This network is generally most active when we are engaged in rumination, self-reflection, thinking about the past and the future. If psychedelics suppress this activity in the default mode network, what seems to happen is that different regions of the brain start talking to one another directly. So you might have an emotion center speaking directly to the visual center, and that essentially allows for a temporary rewiring of the brain. 